the Paris Pike Novice Chase will close day one. It's a two mile six furlong Novice Velvet Diamond at the top four. Graham Clutchman going for a three timer. Dancer on the stage. Martin Leedham, King Partner, Leon Van Rensburg, Cabo Zarad, Darren Thompson, Double Chance, David Hooley, and Ozark Fizz for Vinnie Gerard. So a field of six in this final race of the day. Call in and away. Dancer on the stage. Just the first one to show. So they get to the first. And all safely over the first of the 14 they're going to take. So 13 more to negotiate. And Dancer on the stage, the early leader from Cabo Zarat in second. Pulling for its head, King Partner is third. So they get to the second. And the leader attacked that one. One got away from it nicely. Leads by two. Dancer on the stage. Two double chance down this near side. Just showing second from Velvet Diamond on the outside. Going for the three timer. And Ozark Fizz King Partner and finally Cabo Zarat as they make their way towards the next fence. Dancer on the stage leads into the third. It's over it nicely. Velvet Diamond second, double chance third. What's the chances of me calling that double diamond before the end of the race? Pretty good, I would have thought. But Dancer on the stage in the lead from Velvet Diamond in second as they get to the fourth. They're also for the other, or with King Partner third, Ozark Fizz fourth. Double chance in fifth, and then Cabo Zarad, just the back marker for Darren Thompson. Dancer on the stage continues to show the way. Clear in front from King Partner has now gone into second. Then Ozark Fizz on the inside of Velvet Diamond. Double chance on the road in the purple jacket and the maroon and white sleeves of the back marker Cabo Zarad, just behind him. So they're racing slightly uphill in now inside the final two miles with Dancer on the stage, leading by two lengths into this ditch. Got over it nicely, Ozark Fizz jumped it quickly, so too did Cabo Zarad. Dancer on the stage continues to lead by two to Keen Partner and Ozark Fizz. Double chance and Velvet Diamond and Cabo Zarad. Playing one this time. Also for the that one. With Dancer on the stage, still clear by two. Double chance on the inside of Ozark Fizz and Keen Partner. And Velvet Diamond and Cabo Zarad as they pass the stand. They'll pass the wooden post shortly and they'll have one more circuit of the track. And that will close day one of week six. Week when the National Hunt side of things plays second fiddle really to the happenings at Ascot. More Ascot week on the flat course as they get over the seventh. And they're all safely over the seventh. Dancer on the stage is the leader by a bet. Three dents or so now to King Partner and Double Chance. Cabo Zarad has moved forward. Velvet Diamond is next, and Ozark Fizz is now the back marker. Dancer on the stage is dancing along nicely in the lead. King Partner is second as they get to the next. King Partner a little slow. Double Chance third. Cabo Zarad fourth. Velvet Diamond fifth and Ozark Fizz just the back marker as they come into fence number nine and that time King Partner out jumped Dancer on the stage and jumped into the lead so King Partner Dancer on the stage being driven back up the inside to reclaim the lead as they come into number 10 and again it was a better jump by King Partner also Velvet Diamond has jumped right up into a very close third these three are a couple of lengths clear of Cabo Zara double chance and Ozark Fizz as they're well inside the final mile and it's King Partner by three quarters of a length to Dancer on the stage in second. Velvet Diamond is third and Cabo Zarad is four. Then comes Double Chance trying to make a bit of a move. They've got four to take. This is the fourth from home. Over it goes King Partner. Dancer on the stage and Velvet Diamond. Cabo Zarad was a faller there. Cabo Zarad's gone but it's King Partner in the lead from Velvet Diamond and Dancer on the stage. A six length gap then back to Double Chance as they come to the third last and over the third last they go and Dancer on the stage is gone. Made a really bad mistake. The jockey went out the side door. King Partner in and Velvet Diamond, these two are five or six lengths clear of Ozark Fizz and Double Chance. It's Keen Partner on the inside, Velvet Diamond on the outside. Gap of five then of Ozark Fizz who's under pressure. Then comes Double Chance who looks now on for fourth. It's Keen Partner in the lead from Velvet Diamond in second. Ozark Fizz is running on and getting closer and so too is Double Chance as these leading pair are beginning to slow. They're coming down towards the final two fences. It's Keen Partner on the rail. Velvet Diamond closes to us. Then Ozark Fizz 
Racing Double Chance over the final ditch they go and Velvet Diamond jumps in better here comes Double Chance with a good looking run but he's got five or six lengths to make up there's still a fence to take and two furlongs to race though and it's Keen Partner on the inside Velvet Diamond on the outside Double Chance is running on they're coming out towards the final fence and it's Keen Partner looks like he's only going to jump in but a slow jump and a fall for Velvet Diamond has gone and it's Keen Partner left clear Double Chance is trying to close there's still half a furlong to go Keen Partner's got far enough in front I think to take this one it might be somewhat fortuitous but racing towards the line Keen Partner takes it from double chance in second Ozark Fizz in third and they were the only three that finished and a catalogue of disasters for some of those horses there really with Dancer on the stage probably beaten when she went a velvet diamond might well have been able to put down a challenge though when that one went a key partner takes it for Leon Van Rensburg double chance for David Hooley second Ozark Fizz for Vinnie Gerard was back in third and they were the only three to finish